Hello, dear abdominal folks. I'm Isabel Spradlin of abdominaladhesiontreatment.com. Many of you may already know me, and I'm doing this series of videos that are just quick, short answers to the questions that I get most often about abdominal adhesions, abdominal distress, how to help yourself, what's safe, what's um, what's like the next step if you've been working on it for a while. So that's what these very short videos are all about. Today I am answering the question, what are adhesions? And you, if you've listened to me as I've been interviewed on other podcasts or even read through my own the website at abdominaladhesiontreatment.com, you'll know the answer to this. So, but let's see if you remember correctly. In medical terms, adhesion equals scar tissue. From a practical perspective, adhesion certainly can equal scar tissue, but not all adhesion is true blue scar tissue. So scar tissue are those collagen fibers that help to knit tissues of the body back together. We need scar tissue in order to heal from incisions. Scar tissue can also show up from long-term inflammation, infection, uh, blunt force trauma, anywhere in our body. This is not limited to the belly. Adhesions happen and scar tissue can happen everywhere in the body. In the belly, they become much more problematic because of the presence of the internal organs. We need those internal organs to sustain our life. And so it can get kind of scarier when we start delving into that. But adhesions, essentially, whether it's scar tissue or from a more practical standpoint, just sticky tissue, which is exactly what it sounds like, adhesion, sticky tissue. Um, either way, it's just a place where the tissues of the body, which are all meant to slip and slide over each other so that they can expand and contract and go with you as you move throughout your day, when that stops slipping and sliding quite so well, as you make motion, as you breathe, uh, as you turn over in bed, all of those different types of things, when the tissues get stuck together, it can create all kinds of pain, distress, dysfunction. So again, um, in both the Getting Started program and the Recover program, we go over this in detail, but I just wanted to take a minute, answer that question. Hopefully, if this is your first time encountering this information, it kind of opens some things up for you. So I will see you on our next video. And in the meantime, head over to my website. You can get there by just typing in healmybelly.com to learn more. Lots of articles, blogs, my programs. I'll see you soon.